Well, Josh, a really entertaining game to watch. What was that like to play in? Yeah, um, it was tough. They, um, they, obviously, they move it about the back really well, and sometimes you have to concede the possession to them because they're, they're so expansive, and um, you can kind of hit them on the turnovers, which I thought we did really well today. Perfect goal to open the game. I mean, perfect pass by Chris Berry, and you timed your run to perfection as well. I mean, it couldn't have gone better, could it? Yeah, um, I've been working on it this week, um, making runs from like out to in, and um, Mezzik obviously got the ability to make them passes. So um, yeah, as soon as I made the run, and he got his head up. I, I kind of knew he was always going to find me. A couple of disappointing performances, certainly against Carlisle going out of the FA Cup. And you look as if you're all fired up from the first minute today. Yeah, um, obviously we're all disappointed. Um, nobody wants to lose games, and um, I think we have to also have to look at the run we were on before that and. Um, I think the confidence in the camp, of obviously looking at, looking at the results that we did have, um, if you take away the two Carlisle results, um, I think we, we looked at that and, and obviously the confidence there I thought was really high. I think it's only one defeat in ten in the yeah. league, you know, if you take the, the FA Cup, yeah. it? but as far as today's go, you, just that second goal and that opening half hour when you were dominating thing could have made such a big difference. Yeah, I thought we were the better team comfortably in the first half, um, it's a sloppy goal to give away, but um, yeah, I think if you take away the Carlisle result, like you say, we've I thought we've been uh, relatively relatively good. So um, yeah, it's good another point away, and hopefully we just like, like you say, just respect that point and on to next. A few different formations, but you know, with, with the four at the back, it means you can have Kieran and yourself as the two wide players. You yourself obviously feel quite comfortable in that position. Yeah, like that's where I've um, played for the last few years, so I feel feel comfortable out there. Um, um, I think Kieran's pretty similar. Um, he likes to come inside, so it allows the fullbacks to get round us and and exploit them. So yeah, I thought we thought we'd done it really well today. But the responsibility then to, to track back up and down as well, isn't it? And, yeah. and that, I think that's a part of your game that certainly, from my perspective, you, you've got better and better. Yeah, yeah, um, yeah. Like you say, it's um, some of that I think I've improved on um, when I came in the gaffer. That's what he, he wanted me to do, and um, we've worked really hard on it. Um, like you say, I've, I think I've said before, it hasn't hasn't came overnight. It's took a while, but um, yeah, I'm just keeping working on it and hopefully get better as well. Passing was a lot quicker today, I thought. You know, that gave you the chance to get forward and really yeah. put them under pressure. Yeah, I think that's like you say, against, especially against their back five. I think using our fullbacks, which we did well, um, allowed us to get up the pitch. Um, I think we can do that a lot more. Like you say, get it down, and it allows us, it allows the wingers and the forwards to get across and get high up the pitch. So um, I think we can do that more often, more, and yeah, hopefully we'll continue to do it. I just said to the boss there, I mean, you've played most of the sides now, who are above you near the mm -hmm. top of the, the the table as well, and you know you've really given just about every one of them a really good game. So so uh, is it a bit frustrating, perhaps you're not a little bit higher up in the league than you actually are? Yeah, I think it's frustrating because I think as a group in there we know what we can achieve. Um, like today after that, I think the lads in there, obviously they're happy about the point but also disappointed that we haven't got all three. So um, I think that shows a lot coming here, um, especially where they are on the table. Um, that what we think as a group we can do, so hopefully we can push on and, and get some more wins and move up. Yeah, I mean, I mean goals are the important thing. I was looking at the, the starting lineup today. I think there's only two of the players, at the outfield players, who haven't scored so far this season. But you know, you, you yourself, I'm sure, would like to be scoring more too. Yeah, 100%. Um, with the games, um, when I'm starting, out, I always back myself to score. So when I'm not, I am criticising myself. Um, like you say, yeah, I think as long as we all chip in as a, as a group, um, especially the defenders as well, and they can they can chip in with goals. So this is the whole team effort at the end of the day, and I don't think it goes down who scored who. It's how many goals you score at the end of the season. So um, as eleven on the pitch, we, we all try and score goals. Yeah. And as wide players, really important to make sure you are sort of coming in and getting on that back post when the cross is coming from the other side. Yeah, exactly. Um, I think there's one in the first half. I maybe could have got inside the fullback, um, which I was a bit disappointed when Kieran crossed it. But um, like you say, we work on that in training as well, getting inside the fullback, and and when the crosses are coming in from the other side trying to attack the back post. Just outside the playoffs at the moment, mm -hmm. I mean, you're keeping in touch. Mm -hmm. uh, as I say, you know, you, you went on that really good run of five wins in a row, didn't you? Mm -hmm. you? If you can do something like that again, certainly yeah. you can push yourself inside there. Yeah, we've, um, I, haven't, I actually haven't seen the table, I couldn't get any at Nepal. <laughs> um, we, um, yeah, we, we know if you put a good run of, run of results in this league, you soon move up because it's a, it's a weird old league and everyone beats everyone. I think you've seen Tuesday night some of the results. Um, so yeah, I think, like we say, if we can if we can pick up some good results and, and get to get a few more wins we can we can soon move up the table and at the end there that block down you sort of hobbled out yeah. here and whatever I mean how are you yeah I'm fine yeah um, I just clashed knees with them in the corner just a bit of a sore one but um, I was going to try and run it off but I think the gaffer already <laughs> made a decision to bring me off so um, yeah like you say I'll, I'll be alright I think yeah I was a bit nervous watching those that stoppage time I mean yeah. Ross made a super save at the end didn't he yeah great save when he was called upon I think um, I don't think he really had a great deal to do to, apart from the last five minutes um, 
like you say, it's, it's not nice when you're on the bench and you're watching on because you can't really control what's going on. But um, yeah, I think we, we obviously got grounded out well and um, yeah, good. Yeah. And, and fitness levels yourself at the moment. I mean, away from the you know, the, the little injuries and knocks and whatever. Yeah. I mean, your stamina levels are, are they gaining as well? Do you think? Yeah, I think obviously at the start of the season I wasn't really in that much. Um, then I had that little run of seven, eight games or whatever we had, and I was out last week. But um, yeah, I feel like I'm getting fitter. Um, I think it's hard when you don't start the season playing. You're always playing catch up, but I feel like I'm I'm at it now. So yeah. Uh, and hard when it's been you know game Saturday, Tuesday, Saturday, Tuesday, mm -hmm. and sometimes you need that little bit of space don't you, on the yeah. training ground to improve things. Yeah, exactly. That's it. Um, when you don't have the Tuesday game, I think it's important to use that week to to improve on things that you need to. So yeah, I think we've done that, and obviously I think you showed today in the performance and um, the shape we were in and how we how we uh, counted out of it. I think we were really good. And the Papa John's Trophy now that's the that's the cup you're in. We've been at the FA Cup away at Burton in the next round as well. Did you take some interest in the draw last night? Yeah, yeah, we um, we've seen it. The lads put it in the group that we have Burton away, so um, we look forward to it. Hopefully, go there and get a win. I think it's it's a it's a competition that we can do well in. So uh, every competition we try and win it. So um, yeah, it's a good good place to go and hopefully get a win. And you've had some good results away from home so far mm -hmm. this season, and then those three home games in a row didn't quite yeah. go the way you wanted to. Important to back this draw up with a, a win over Wimbledon next week. Yeah, I think it's just about starting games properly I think the last obviously Carlo we didn't really give ourselves any chance conceding within 40 seconds I think it gave them the chance to sit in and, and do what the what they probably came to do so um, it became hard but like you say I think um, I think we can back this up now and hopefully get a few more wins and, and like you say we move up the tail because a few wins can, can shoot you up and finally about goals have you set yourself a target for the season um, I, I don't really set myself targets but I like to try and think that I can get double figures so um, yeah hopefully I can keep scoring goals and, and help assist them as well